Okay, go to there. We then have nothing fiery to launch, sadly. But I can do this. Spontaneous combustion, which will hopefully hurt. Critical hit. Nice. I'll take that. I'm going to watch the other guy's health a little bit. But now that he's down, we can knock him down. I'm going to go for a battering ram. He's not blocked. Oh, that did nothing. That's not fair. <laughs> I called cheat on that. Hmm. I better get some uh, shields up on these other guys, I think. Infect. Uh, he's too far away, really? Yeah, I can't, I can't get a shot on that from there. I'd have to move in, which is far too dangerous to do. Can I teleport someone? He's just out of range, isn't he? Damn. Hang on. Teleport him to there. <laughs> I'll do the damage this way. <laughs> and then I can actually walk in a bit further. I'd quite like to stay in that blood if I can. Have a disease. Nice. Mm, I am I am playing a bit risky with my own health there, but Earth immunity, immune to poison damage. Oh, this is getting very messy very fast here. Use Living Edge on the spiky trunk. Why? What's that going to do? So he's teleported into some fire. Shackles of pain on pain. Uh, none of this looks good. Right, he's got Shackles of Pain. He'll receive damage when the caster takes damage. Do I kill myself for the sake of it? I think I probably do. Can't cast it on the height up there. That's something that annoys me. That um, Can I get rid of Shackles of Pain in any way? What's this? Supernova. Fire Whip. It's probably not worth it. I'm sitting in poison. I can probably heal through it. Yeah, if I stay in the poison, I should be all right there. Uh, I have to watch out for the others, though. I think a good old earthquake. I like a good old earthquake. Well, he's knocked down, so that's good. He didn't take much damage himself. I'm going to cast... No, I'm not going to cast Flaming Tongues because I quite like staying around poison. I don't want to set that on fire. I'm going to cast Haste on uh, the warrior. No, I can't. I cannot see him. I'm too far away. Bollocks. Ignition sets enemy character... No, that's, no, that's not a good position to do that in. Uh, would this help? I can, actually, can I cast that on him? Hang on, if I can do that, I can cast haste on him. Yeah, I can. Okay, I just need to... No, I can't. It's not going to let me see him, is it? Oh, bollocks. Oh, I can do that one, though. Oh, God, that wasn't what I thought. <clears throat> Was that... It was the clear mind I wanted. <laughs> well, never mind. We didn't like any of them characters anyway. Hmm. What is my best bet here? The Mend Metal, the Fortify. The Fortify, maybe, to get rid of the burning. Yeah, let's do that. Take a massive potion. And sadly, I can... Can I do this? Yes, I can. 
Oh, don't jump over there. Don't. No, you're not supposed to be over there. Right, crap. Okay, uh, drastic times now. Very, 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 very drastic times. Rain. We want uh, armor of frost, I think. Soothing cold. 47 magic armor return. No, 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 no. Just, 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 just that now to help keep me alive that would keep me alive some more I'm oh what have I just done was I cursed or the undead thing oh bollocks mistakes were made Ooh, in that case then I could do that or I could take a potion that might be my best bet Let's, let's, let's keep alive for another turn. Well, did I still have the thing? Oh, it, it turned to red, though. It'd gone from purple. It wasn't red anymore. So I killed myself by hitting myself. Uh, I'm good there. Thanks for the follow. All right, see you later, King Rat. This is, uh, this has gone slightly wrong. Just, just, just slightly wrong. What have I got here? I could do a, uh... I don't want to battle stomp. I want two big hits here. That was a nice hit. Oh, but because it's physical damage, I'm killing poor old Fane as well. Right, I am... Wow, this couldn't be going much more wrong if I tried. Medium air resistance. I'm not going to get him on this. Let's, let's go for that. Bit of healing. <laughs> Tactical suicide is exactly what it is. Yeah. Severus. Could you play this game mainly with your right hand? Uh, that sounds really nasty, actually. That injury sounds terrible. I hope you managed to get over that. Uh, yes, you can, because it's turn-based combat. It'll involve a lot of clicking with the mouse. But um, you certainly can. I don't think there's any keyboard shortcuts you need. All the movement is by mouse. And you can click on these buttons and then click on the target. So that will work as well. Red Orc, thanks for the follow. Uh, that's a really nasty injury. I, I hope uh, hope you're able to uh, to overcome that. All, uh, you know, good luck to you. I'll just take a couple of weeks. Ah, right, okay. I, I thought that would sound like you were going to be knackered for months. Thanks for the follow as well. Those, those are scary injuries. Right, okay. I might need to go for the, the damage here regardless. But what I'll do is I will turn into a human. No, I need the shields up. Where's my shields up? Did I... Did I... Hang on a sec. That should have... That should be on there. Skills from items. I am still wearing that thing, aren't I? I'm not equipping a shield? Why the hell not? Did I swap it round or something? How did that happen? Alright, that is a waste of a point, but... Uh, it might be the thing that saves me, sadly. Did that go on? It did. That, that should be... Let me just unlock that. Put that over here, because I know where to look for it over there. Something else has moved as well. Now then, do I do that, or do I try and... I think I have to I have to do this. I don't think I have any option in the matter. I'm ready. Also I could walk into the poison and heal up, so let's let's do that too. So that's not the killing blow I hoped it was gonna be. Oh I got disease, that lowered the constitution so I didn't have enough stats to equip the shield. Ah, that makes sense. Avenger cheers. I wondered what had stripped it off me. I was trying to think if I'd uh, taken it off at any point. Rise. Tell you what, there are some seriously hard fights in this graveyard area. For all the levels aren't particularly too tough. Or should, I don't look too tough. It's uh, it's challenging me. Divinity 1 on PS5? Hey, you'll like that. You will. You, you'll like it. It's a good game. Uh, hopefully it's the Enhanced Edition, because the Enhanced Edition has all the um, voice acting in. Whereas I, I think the basic original edition of that doesn't. Or not as much, anyway. I might be wrong with that. 
So we're back to you again. Have you still got this stupid shackles of pain thing? Oh, God, he has. Oh, my God. Look at his health. Right. We've got very few options here. So I have to drink the poison. I can't zap him with one of them because he's on a different level. Hang on. I just poisoned myself, but that's... What? Oh, is it because I've got lizard form? So I've poisoned myself. Oh. I need to cancel that thing for a start. Turn into a lizard. No. I need to cancel that. I just assumed, yes, I revert to original form. So now poisoning myself would actually keep me alive. <laughs> yeah, we're, we're going strongly backwards here. I knew there was a reason I didn't keep those forms on in combat. So I can't... I can take another one. No, that still kills him. What did I have then? Because in undead form, poison heals you. So what, what debuff did I have that would... Oh, I don't know. I think this is a, a mute, po mute point anyway, so let's uh, let's load that back in from wherever that was. Actually, I don't know where that was. That's a long time. No, it's not a long time ago. It's fine. Um, I didn't look at the, the debuffs there. I assumed I I took the poison potion and died because I was in lizard form. I thought, oh, okay, I'm not undead anymore. Yes, all right, that's that's my fault. Then I took another poison potion in undead form. It's the decay. Well, surely decay doesn't work both ways. Uh, oh, we're in this state, are we? Right. What time is it? It's half seven. I was going to stop streaming half an hour ago. Should we try this again? I mean, this is just a horrid fight. What I can Actually, what I'm going to do, I'm going to cheat. We've come in. We've saved the game, have we? Because we know what's going to happen. Yeah. <laughs> So what I'm going to do is actually... Right, let's cancel that. Let's get out of that. Because I am going to get the first go on this. Poor old beast. He got absolutely nuked before. Is there somewhere better he can go? Tactical retreat. I can put him right next to him. Actually, that's... No, it's probably not the wisest thing to do. I'll put him here. And let's see. Right, save the game. The only thing that isn't affected by decay is necromancy healing. So it does go both ways. Decay turns everything that heals to damage. Uh, that is a, a nuisance. I'll have to see if I can find some way of removing that quickly. Right then. What shall we drink? I don't have any potions. It's three intelligence. Will that increase my damage? Take a look at the intelligence. Also, let's take this silly hat off and put some better stuff on. Because I could do the stats, I think. Gear. What have you got? I mean, you should have some... Oh, have I sold it? No, I can't have done. He had a cowl on there. Maybe I... When did I put that on, though? This can't be true. This, this can't be true. Because... I thought I might have sold it back in town, but I have... I came back here, and then I put the lizard mask on. Unless it counted the elf mask. Oh, maybe I have sold it in town. So I have absolutely nothing I can put on his head. Really? Did I really get rid of everything? Wow, that was... That was a mistake, then. Seems to have gone. The only thing I've got 
Let's take that out. That's really annoying me that that's hiding in there. Uh, it's on somebody. Oh, hang on. But he's in discussions. If I put that on, I think he'll get the curse. That's the only other thing I've got. Well, we're sticking with that then, in that case. Let's wind up a big attack. Here we go. Should I move in? Or should I just go with the fireball? I'm just going to go with the fireball. Eat that, you bastard. Yeah, it's a fight. It's a fight. <laughs> and Beast is going to die straight away. He's going to summon a load of stuff. Beast is nearly dead. Beast is... Oh, he cheated death. Fantastic. He cheated death. Do I have the anti-poison thing? Not prepared. Uh, where does he get to go? Well, he might still be there if we're lucky. So I'm just going to pile as much fire onto him as I can. Not with that, I'm not. It'd be good to stand in the poison cloud myself, actually. But let's just do full fire damage. Do I have anything else nice and nasty that I can ignite? And I will not be casting that, because that definitely caused me some trouble. Let's see if we can ignite him a bit more. I mean, I'm going to have to really focus fire on this guy. Hey, Pam, how's it going? We are in a very dangerous fight here. Oh, Beast is dead. I can't keep him alive for the first turn. I would have to go in with some sort of um, anti-poison thing on. Right, we're going straight in. We must be able to see. No, it's not going to let us do that. This is a very bad situation to be in. Now can I... I can't. I still can't do a Phoenix dive. Oh, crap. I wanted to get stuck in there. Oh well, I'll jump in there. We'll put a fire sur surface down and we will crippling blow. Because that will cripple that thing, if nothing else. It will go through. Now, whether I can... Do I want to resurrect Beast and bring him back to the fight? Is the question. Do some magical armor back. You know what, I think I probably do. Yeah, go on, I'm going to cast this. Is that a three-pointer? Oh, God, it is. But it brings him back in the fight, so it might be, might be worth it. Just come back here where you are not immediately going to get attacked. And apply a little bit of armor of frost, because armor of frost is quite good. I, I suspect Beast is going to die straight away, but we'll see, see what that does. I don't tend to use resurrection spells in combat. Oh, what I should do, because he's got a source point, is I should spend that source point on this character at the earliest opportunity. Oh, I cheated death again and then died. <laughs> don't you dare, don't you dare use it. Nope, he's used source vampirism. Crap. That makes him very dangerous indeed. Right, are you actually poisoned? You are at the moment. What it really annoys me that I cannot use that spell because of um, because he's upper level. I can't aim that up. Really, really bugging me. Can I get him with a fire whip? Not without moving in. Can I get uh, right? Move that way. Can I hit him from there. Zap you bastard! Eat that. Poisoned. Poisoned is good. Poisoned is good on that. Should we kill this thing? I think we can probably kill this thing. I need to heal up though, urgently. So let's go for physical armor one. This is a very tough engagement. Heal. And then let's let loose with a whirlwind, I think. 
The Blitz is tempting. Now, I'm going to go with the Whirlwind. It'll get all of these. Will it, though? It did! Nice. Mm, that's a lot of firepower coming in. He can shield up, though. So he can. He can shield up. He's not too bad. Is he standing in the blood? If he is, then I can also... Yeah, let's do that. Get rid of his armor. Immune to bleeding. I think that heals me, though. So that's good. He doesn't have a shield on anymore. Yes, he does. I'm going to trigger that before I lose it. There we go. I am going to soak up all this damage. Fane is... Hopefully okay because of the poison issue. So a lot of stuff coming in over there. I see him running off there. He's come down. I can zap him now. Oh, God. He just very, very smartly just walked through the fire. That was a, a, a wise move. A very wise move. But I think he might have stuffed himself because I think I can... Nice. That was a decent-sized hit. Um... I don't have enough action points to do that. I'm not decayed, so I could heal. This word removes blinded, terrified, charmed, etc, etc. What's that one? That is just flanked. That's not a problem. Necrofire, poisoned. And you've got, you've got poison as well. And acid. And a magic shell, though, so that's something. I have nothing left I can really attack with. I'm going to go for a haste. And we're going to haste you. Okay. Let's hope that was the right choice. Keep that poison coming in. Right. Can you please do... No, you can't. Can't do the phoenix dive. And do a battering ram. Yes, I can. He's knocked down. He's on his ass. Big hit. Come on, don't miss. Right, he's dead. Ha! That was much better. That was considerably better, but at the same time, this is also very dangerous in here, and we need to put some fires out fast. Nobody move a muscle. It's okay, I think we're sorted now. Ooh, that was a very tricky fight. Poor old Beast. Beast was a marked dwarf in that. He was he was going to die no matter what happened there. So the resurrection in the middle of combat wasn't wasn't that great, but I don't know, maybe it uh, absorbed a hit that would have knocked out one of my other guys. Also, we're going to do a very quick quick save there. And save again. So this is a very dangerous place to be. I don't know if this leads anywhere. I hope it doesn't. Let me go and see what we've got on the, the big boss guy. They always target the most fragile character. I think I need to boost his constitution up a little bit. Which there might be an opportunity to do that here. Poison wave skill book. I think. I think he has that but we'll, we'll check. A glorious ring, pyrokinetic, necromancer, and some very nice magic armor. I tell you what, I'm going to loot all these on the same character, and then we will see where they go. The uh, diviner's hands. Oh, that's nice. That's that's going to uh, Thane, I think. And an air wand of the lizard. Yeah, okay. Loot loot all the stuff. I'm going to loot all the stuff and then hand it out afterwards. Poisonous trunk. So it was basically sitting on this good stuff up here, this chest armor. Okay, yeah, we're going to actually get to see what that is. It's an intelligence thing. It's a lot of magic armor. Intelligence, constitution, wit, fire resistance, air resistance, retribution, and necromancer. 
Um, I'm thinking... If in for that one. Yeah, it's basically... Apart from the, the summoning one, he gets the necromancer bonus. It's that's yeah, it's far too good not to uh, not to use. New skill bone cage. Did it also? Oh, I, I missed that. Well, that's quite handy. And that um, I don't think that'll be good for anyone. Pyrokinetic. Yeah, I'm I'm seeing a pattern here. Anyway, this stuff. This might be. They've got Alexander's Cloak, which is Strength and Retribution, though. Grant skill, Mass Cleanse Wounds. Uh, does it? Because I've never seen that on my action bar. Not once. Well, there you go. It's a source point, that's why. Okay, we'll not use that then, but this one. Um, yes. And you, hit points. 42 hit points is a hell of a lot. I could put that onto Beast though, couldn't I? Go on then, which, which one am I changing here? That one, 42 hit points. I might regret that. I might well regret that. Diviner's hands. I'd lose. F I'm gaining. I'm both. I'm gaining a lot, but at the same time, I'm losing hit points in these. But they are better. And a magical wand of the air. Yeah, I think that's um, the life steal is nice. You probably need this, do you? I'm going to equip it. I don't know if those points and the other things are really worth going for it. Really? I've got a level 4 thing. That, that is terrible. 8 hit points. Poison resistance versus... Yeah, it's maybe not that bad. I was going to give that to someone. Oh, that's... that's. Hang on. Let me just see. What have you got? Wits and Huntsman or just Huntsman? Um, I think we'll replace that sapphire ring there. We'll have the uh, extra hit points. And that... I don't think that's really worth anything to anyone there. Okay, well, we've got some good stuff. We've improved the party a little bit, but by God, that was a, a fairly dangerous and scary fight. Let me get out of this if we can. Yeah, a beast needs some resistances boosting, I would think. These guys might talk to me now. The spirit looks angry. Search his memories. You have been a spirit for a very long time indeed. This afterlife has been spent resisting the pull of the ancestor tree that wants your source. You've always hated the scion of the tree for seeking your destruction. Once he served the hated mother tree, you hate her too. But now, the scion has taken a darker path. But he still wants your source. Let the spirit know it's free to go where it may go. The tree is no more. Relief flows through you as a realization grows. You may leave. The spirit slips away. All of them? By the way, I never did learn what the other way of me gaining source easily was. Because I... I can't remember. Other than teleporting back to a, a place where I can pick it up from a, a puddle... Um, I don't know. So if anyone wants to remind me, please feel free to remind me, because I say it's been two months since I played this. A wave of relief washes off the spirit. Relief tempered with disgust. Search the memories. You are an elven spirit. Who you were in life is now forgotten. You have spent the years resisting the pull of the Ancestor Tree. It would steal your source. This source you would gladly give to the Mother Tree. But not this traitor. This sign has betrayed the Elves. This sign has taken a darker path. 
This scion wants your source for someone or something else. Not anymore, he doesn't. This, you think, is what happens when the scions don't hmm. get proper training. Let the spirit know it's free to go where it may. The tree is no more. Relief flows through you as you realize that you may leave. Your thoughts flash to the mother tree by the water on an island with no name. The spirit slips away. Well, I think we're doing the right thing here. The spirit looks forlorn, exhausted, spent. Nothing remains of the life you led. The long years after death, resisting the tree as it tried to take your source, have left you with little more than an overwhelming sense of betrayal. It's free to go. Relief flows through you. The spirit slips away. Big bonus XP? No? Disappointing. The spirit of a dwarf frowns at you. I don't hear any pickup. We can't be wasting time. Haven't you seen the excavator? The site's close. I think we listened to that yes. before, didn't we? Um, the spirit there's something about an empress why there. Why wasting everyone's time? Get to the site before the empress sees. Tell me more about this empress. You don't know the outlaw empress. She got you for the disrespect. So best get digging before she gets back. The site's close. Okay, that's just a new little line we didn't know. The chronicler. The spirit keeps glancing back. How can I help? If I knew the way, I... quit idling. The chronicler puts his head in his hands. Nothing new there either. Okay, so we shall. Um, you know, spirit of a mass servant and spirit of a lizard. Oh, maybe I should talk to that lizard again. Let me just go and talk to that lizard after I smash the chest open. To see an elf burning the body of kin, it turns one's stomach. I bet it does. Also, I am against my better judgment. <laughs> I'm going to cast this spell again. And I'm going to cancel it straight afterwards as well. Source vampirism? I don't know if I have any to ability for that. Burning the body okay, I thought there might be something good there. Uh, clearly there is not. It doesn't look like... I mean, I... Someone said in chat, I have an easy way to get source now. I have no idea. I don't know, I don't know what they're referring to. Um, I, I think... I'm on a quest to learn how to do that at the moment, but I'm not there yet. Uh, let's have a look. Oh, it's not these. not Seed of Power, is it? That's something else. Powerful Awakening. Which one was it? Mastering the source. Find the region's rogue sorcerers. The Magister's list. Rogue sorcerers locked in the barrack cellar. We need teachers in the views of the source. Blah, blah, blah. Gather the ingredients for the Godwoken ritual. Is it Meister's Cellar? Does they have a load of sauce down there? Meister Seaver. I can't remember. Maybe it is. Maybe it is somewhere to go back to. Uh, let's go and check that out then, if that's a thing. Where is her cellar? It's up there, isn't it? Can I, not, um, I wish I could... I guess because I've been playing Celasta Crown of the Magister. One of the really cool features of that is that you can go into the map and you can click on where you want to go and your characters start walking there. It's, it's really nice when you want to just move around places. Can we go in this way? Can we go have a look down the cellar? Maybe there's some source down there. It is Master Seaver's house. Okay. Oh, we've missed that. Oh, it's empty anyway. Where's the hole in the floor? Aha! A nice supply of sauce. Yes, let's go and get stocked up. Then again, if they're going to use uh, nasty old vampirism on me, sauce vampirism, it's kind of dangerous. Come on, come on, stock up. 
Somebody needs it. Who needs it? I think I... Did I get two people at once in there? That was a bonus. And back to the Stone Garden Graveyard. And we still never got to that crypt down in the south that I wanted to. Imagine the game lets you bring a bottle of those sorts. Can you do that? Can you fill an empty bottle with sauce and carry it around with you? A flask. Not that I have any. I've not thought to do that, but maybe I should. <clears throat> also, I do need a new headdress as well. Can't believe I got rid of the, uh, the old one. I guess that would have been a chance to buy it back, wouldn't it? But we'll loot one. Anyway, that is me for today, for, for sure. Um, I will be back on Thursday. We'll continue this. We're going to go down into that Surrey crypt, which I've been planning to do for ages. We might even go back into the petrifying chamber now that we know how that fight's going to go and have a massive scrap down there. And we still need to get into the uh, Riker's Rest House as well. There's a lot to do. There's so much to do with this game. It's, it's something I really like about it. Although you do tend to forget what you were trying to do from time to time. Get distracted. So, folks, have a great couple of days. Thanks for uh, hanging out today. And welcome to all the new followers. And I'll see you again on Thursday afternoon. Good night for now.